Well guys, sadly, this is our last day in Bangkok. And I can't tell you enough how much I really enjoyed our journeys together here in this incredible, wonderful town. Not over yet. Before I leave, I wanted to make sure I checked out the San Feng Market, which is a daytime market. I'm hungry, I haven't eaten anything, and I'll bet they've got some really interesting trinkets that we can look at. And as usual, we'll also enjoy the incredible sights and sounds along the way. Whoa, let's not get hit by a scooter. Though. So join me as we head over to San Feng. What's up here? Smells good. It's almost impossible to walk a block even without seeing something that really catches your attention and begs you to pull over. This is one such street. Look at this. What are those? Apricots? Yeah, they almost look like eggs. Beautiful. This is a really local market right here, guys. When you see locals arriving in a tuk-tuk, you know you're in the right place. Man, look at those tomatoes. Little cherry tomatoes and tiny strawberries. Sorry, cow. All right, guys, if I see anything that tickles our fancy, I'll be sure to check it out. Hold on, this guy's flagging me over. Let's see what he's got. Whoa, let's not get hit by the scooter. Oh, the champions, New England Patriots. Cool. Yes, I am. Barefoot vlogger on YouTube. Who are you, sir? Yes, come to visit Naira Creation. Come to visit this location. What do you got? Diamond jewelry. Diamond jewelry? Where are yeah. the diamonds from? Diamond from Belgium, Hong Kong, America, really? India. Really? Can you show us some? Yeah, yes, come. Let's Why check not? it out. I will show you. Hold on. I'll take my shoes off. I don't want to mess the guy's place up. Now I'm barefoot. What do we got? Is that diamond Come jewelry? Naira, Naira Creations dealing in diamond jewelry. Is, Is it real it? diamonds? Real yeah, diamonds? Real diamonds. All are the real diamonds. Where are you from? You're from India? I'm India, but I live in Thailand from 20 years. Nice. Um, so how would these prices here compare to the ones in America? Is it similar? Uh, is a diamond a diamond like no matter where you buy like, it? Show me. Like, like suppose this one. That's a diamond? Yeah. This but is it's a, blue. This is a blue sapphire color stone and surrounding here is a diamond. Are you sure that's a diamond? Come on, man. It's blue. There's no blue diamonds. This is a blue stone. The guy likes blue. He's got a blue shirt. Yeah. Too. And then like the, the diamond is surrounding. You can see the surrounding? Yeah. Yeah, there's a diamond. And it didn't get white gold. The diamond's on the outside. What's on the inside? Inside what? is a blue sapphire from Sri Lanka. Natural. Oh, that's a sapphire. Yeah, sapphire. Right. And then... But we don't want to see sapphires. We want to see diamonds. Give me a diamond. What's the biggest diamond you got in this joint? Uh, oh. diamonds? Uh-oh. Don't worry. I'm not a no, robber, no. I swear. Yeah, I want to see a big diamond. What about that? Is that a diamond? That's not yeah, a diamond? All that that square one? Yeah, all that That's pretty big. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. Look at that monster. Holy crap. All the diamonds. I can only imagine what that goes for. I trade you my amulet. You want to trade my amulet? I'll say I wouldn't do it. Oh. I wouldn't trade this. I wouldn't trade this amulet for that diamond. Yeah, I you do can it. do the surrounding on with the diamonds. Most what? Diamonds. You can do the surrounding with. You can put diamonds around my amulet. Yes, yes, really? can do. Yes. My goodness. All right. So what do we got? How much are these babies? Oh, he's breaking out the calculator. Yes, which he's like. He's breaking out the calculator. All right. Okay, like this one. Yeah, what do you got? Normally, sir, we are selling this at $1,500, but if you, uh, somebody is take, giving the order, yeah. then we can give like $1,100. $1,100? Yes. For that? Yes. Why is it so cheap? It's not the cheap, it's the small diamond, like a five piece together. No, the big one in the middle, what is no, that? It's, it's That's not a, not a diamond? It's a diamond, but it's not the single piece, it's like a, a set by five pieces. Oh, it's not a single piece. Wow, yeah. it looks like a single piece. But it looks like a one piece. Same like this. Oh. This is look like a one piece, but there's a five piece. 
What yeah, about this? this? That's one piece. Yeah, this is a single piece. All right, so single piece. That's a monster right yeah, there. That thing's like got to be. That's not going to be eleven, fifteen hundred, whatever you just said. Two thousand three hundred fifty dollar. That's it? Yeah. How many carats? Sixty. Zero point six zero. Not even the one carat. One carat. Not no. even. Uh, Wait, that's not one piece. That's got to be one piece. The center no? is a one piece and surrounding is a small piece. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the center piece, that's a, a big... Piece, how many yeah. carats is that big 0. center? 0.58. Come on, dude. That's got to be like 10 carats, that thing. That thing is no. huge. That thing is huge. Yeah. No, no, no. It's, a, it's, a, it's a less than a one carat. Near to half carat. Oh, no. It's been a while, I guess, since I shot for one of those. But, okay. So, how much is that? It's 2350 Why is it so cheap? It's not the cheap, is that it? Uh, it's a wholesale price. Really? If, yeah, if you go in like America, it's Dude, more in America, a diamond like that would cost you 20 grand. Yeah, $3,000 more than $3,000. At least? Yes. Wow, I don't know. I guess it's been a while since I shot for diamonds. Yeah. All right, what is your name, sir? My name is Shivraj Loda from Naira Creation. What he said. Naira right, Creation. You can go to the Instagram page yeah. as, at Naira Creations. All right. And if you like the diamond jewelry, visit to the Thailand. Or we can send to you also. Not an issue. All of that good stuff. Thank what, you. What would you pay for an amulet like that? What would you pay for something like that? Like what? So you want it to be diamond? No. This right here, the way it is. What, how no, much? I, I don't, I what don't do you know. think it's worth? Take a guess. I don't know really. Take a guess. I, no, no. I never did it in the business. So I, what if you had to? If your life depended on mm -hmm. it, you got to take a guess what this amulet costs. What would you say? Take a guess. Give me a number. Uh, Shoot no. one out. No, Come on. no, no. Shoot no. one out. I can't say anything. What is this? Gold or silver or like? How old it is? It's not gold, it's not silver. What would you say? Yeah. Dip, no, take I a guess. Cannot, I cannot say. Come oh, on. They want you to take a guess. They're going to come here and they're going to no, buy your stuff if you take a guess. I know, but if I, he doesn't take a guess, don't buy nothing. <laughs> Ready? Go. Guess. No problem. Give me a number. If I don't know, then I cannot be in taking a guess. Oh, okay. He's too official. All right. <laughs> I, I, you know what? I can respect that. No, I can respect I cannot that. be fast. Things I want to say. Yeah, yeah. But it's more fun this way. Yeah. All right. Come on. The jewelry man, ladies come and here. gentlemen. Come here. The jewelry man. All right. Hey, look at all. He's looking me up already. He's got all these things here, guys. We can see the jewelry. Yeah, but do you really know what that does when you look into it? Yeah, yeah. Then they work. They work inside. The guy in Chinatown was looking through one, but he didn't know what it, he didn't know what he was looking at. No, you know what you're looking at. Yeah. All right. He yeah. knows what he's looking. Yeah. Yeah. We can see here. We can see the zoom. All right. With the, like a twenty X. Should I put my amulet under there? Yeah, yeah. You can put it and you can see. Yeah. Hey, come on. And here's the design. You can come all here. Right. Is the design oh, he's got more stuff over here. Yeah. Look at this. There you go. He's yeah. got it all, ladies and gentlemen. He's got it all. All right, I gotta go. We'll, we'll, yeah. Go buy. We'll buy some diamonds. We'll, we'll, diamonds are forever. You, 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 diamonds you, you, are a girl's best friend. All that good stuff about diamonds. Oh yeah, I forgot my shoes. Oh, that was interesting. You know, guys, I'm pretty freaking hungry, and we got a little bit of a hike. It's gonna be about a 40-minute walk. What does this say? Le Chen. Food rooftop. We gotta at least go take a look at the rooftop. How do you get up there though? I don't think it's open yet. Foiled again. All right. We'll keep walking, we'll find something. Hey Siri, what's the temperature right now? It's about 92 degrees outside. 92 degrees. It's 61 in South Florida right now. They got a cold front that came through. It's 92 here in Bangkok. I think we know who wins that contest. Looks like these chickens got a while to go. Gotta love that rice. Oh, break out the bamboo ladders. Guys, um, there's a famous noodle soup that's made here, but unfortunately they're closed. This gentleman was good enough to remind me of why I remembered this hotel. It's called Talak Kia. 
uh, cafe. It's a nice boutique style hotel. So, and they serve food here and I'm hungry. So you said it only takes like 10 minutes to make this. They're, they're known for this dish called Chinese black olive fried rice. Does that sound great? Okay, I'm gonna try one. Yes. yes. <laughs> to be honest with you, I needed to use their restroom. And um, so of course I will patronize the place. I mean that in every good way. We'll try that rice. It will give us some sustenance until we get to where we're going. And as you can see, we still have uh, 1.6 kilometers, 22 minutes to get there. So, so this will help. Cozy little spot, maybe. There's like almost too many choices to eat in this town, guys, which is a great problem to have. Oh, sure. Thank you. So kind of you. Question is, did it come out of the tap? Tastes just like Florida water. Ah, right, here we go. Awesome. Wow, that's amazing. An egg on there and everything. Thank you so much. Guys, can you see this thing? Like a giant scrambled egg on there. It should be on the cover of some magazine. Look at this, guys. This is a fried rice olive dish with rice. No rice stuff in here. This looks like there's some kind of sauce here. Do you know what the sauce is, sir? Uh, is it very spicy? No, it's a salt. Salt. Salt? Yeah. Like soy sauce? Salt? Yes, but it's a uh, salt. It's salty. Yeah, so, uh, okay. not salty, like, like uh, lambs. It's okay. Sour. Sour. Oh, oh <laughs> thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, it's sour. Thank you. All right. Look at that, how pretty that is. All those colors, like a little medley there, a little rainbow. I'm going to try it without the sauce. Mm. Rice is great. Nothing. It's the greatest egg of all time. You just can't go wrong here, anywhere. Sausage? I think so. It's good. You're getting nothing but the freshest ingredients here. Few of those chilies in there. Oh well. Mmm. A nice meal in the books and in our bellies. Very nice people there and uh, good spot. That's not too far from Chinatown, but also pretty close to Salon. Anyway, guys, let's continue our journey. Onward and upward. Fanning the flames of delicious food. Big hooks. Wow, that's some cable, man. Yeah. Look at those hooks. Yeah. What is this for boats? For boats? Boats. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Can I feel it? Wow. Oh, it's greasy too. It's like uh, sticky. Sticky, man. <laughs> is he gonna cut it? He's gonna cut it. Oh yes. No, oh. something is. You want to speak English? Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay, guys. Do your thing. I don't want to bother you there. Oh, look at that. Oh, you made me a noose. Yeah. Baby? Oh. You trying to tell me something? Oh, there. He's got them all there. Look at that. Oh, there's more here. Look at this. Wow. 
I told you guys about those sidewalk motorcycle riders. <laughs> and you guys were giving me shit for the scooter on the sidewalk? Hey, there he is. Hold on. Who do we got? Well, what's going on, buddy? How are you? Nice to meet you. Greetings from United States of America. Uh, here like I don't know some kind of some kind of chemical they're using guys I think what I'm smelling is uh, seeing a lot of shoot stores hair I don't know Maybe it's something that they're using in uh, relation to shoes. Whether they're fixing them or, I don't know what, polishing them. <laughs> I doubt that, but definitely, uh, definitely has a strong chemical smell that is just uh, permeating the air right now. Blowing out onto my shins. I'll let him go ahead of me. And him too. And him. Oh! It's a regular throughway. It's the world's smallest watermelons. Baba. Baba? Ah. 50 ba for a baba. Yeah, baba. Let's hear it for baba, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. So if you guys were wondering why I brought you back to uh, not the exact same part of town, because we have to, like I said, we're going to a Samfang market, but I wanted you to see hello, the difference between the daytime and the nighttime. You can see all that raw fish walking around. What are these things? They look like mini eggplants. Anybody know? Kumquats? I don't know. I don't know what a kumquat looks like, let alone how to spell it. Shrimp? Shrimp. Shrimp Krispies, a new breakfast treat. Oh, we got a truck coming through. Truck coming through. I tell you what, it's hard enough as a pedestrian walking down these streets and alleys. How the guys on the scooters, let alone a truck, do it? I guess uh, they're very patient. You got a whole family on there. I'm gonna go back and follow the GPS. You 
Oh, we got the red Chinese New Year shirts. Very pretty. Hopping over the dishes. Oh man, I'm going against the traffic too. Okay, we're back on our route. Continuing the journey to the Samfeng Market. Do you guys speak English? Speak English? Yes. Is this Samfeng Market right here? Or no, is this Samfeng just... Market here. I gotta keep going. So, oh, no, no. so this is Chinatown? Here. No, Chinatown is there. Well, what is this? Samfeng Market. So this is Samfeng Market yes. right now. I'm in it. Yes. Where, is this the main part or keep going? Keep going. Keep going. Thank you so much. All right. I appreciate it. Okay. All right. Because you know what, guys? This thing's telling me to keep going, but I'm looking at it and I'm like, I, I don't think this is Chinatown proper. I think this is what they consider a Samfang market, but I don't know. We got a lot of locals watching the channel right now. Welcome and thank you. So please, straighten me out in the comments. You guys have been so uh, kind and generous with your warm welcome and also giving me information. So uh, let me know. How are you? Speak English? Hello. Hey. Where are you from? Thailand. You're from Thailand? Thailand. Is it yeah. Samfeng Market right here? Yeah. Samfeng? Yes, right now. Okay, thank you. All right, he's from Thailand, so he knows more than the Australian guy or English guy or whatever he was. <laughs> nice guy, though. Nice guy. Guys, this market is something else. All of these arteries. Whoa. Hello. Speaking of arteries. Uh, arteries leading to veins leading to smaller capillaries all of these alleys and oh look at this guy with the boxes he's got the boxes is that UPS whoa just getting through here is part of the entertainment in and of itself just to walk through it there's so much activity and action going on here it's uh it's a lot of fun. What's that? Fish burgers or something? Oh, I, I've seen these. These are uh, cookies, I think. Cookies? What are they? Cookies? Cookies. Very good. And they got waffles, too. Look at that. Waffles, guys. Come get your waffles. Where's the eggs? You got eggs, too? See what I mean? They got, they got alleys everywhere. So just out of curiosity, guys, the GPS is telling me to keep going. So I'm not sure if it's just showing me where the entire market runs or it wants me to go to a specific part of it. But uh, I'm going to keep going this way either way. You see the steam rising from the corn on the cob. Karaoke on the go here. I love it. I am vlogging in Samfeng Market here in the Chinatown district of Bangkok, Thailand. This is a cool place, guys. I'll tell you what, if you got some money to burn, come here. They got all kinds of trinkets. Why do you have food, man? Well, I, got, I know. Yeah, I know. Trust me. I'll tell you the story if you want to know. Yeah, lovely. Okay, where are you from? I'm from Poland, man. You're from Poland? From Warsaw, Warsaw, baby. Warsaw. <laughs> not many people like Warsaw. I have nothing against it, but... You got nothing against it. He's just like, get me the hell out of there. <laughs> no, so the reason I wear shoes is, first of all, you can't walk around barefoot yeah, here, yeah. right? So my name is really a metaphor, mostly, you know, it's uh, for being free. I'm from Florida in the U.S., and the mailmen in the 1800s used to deliver the mail on the beach, on foot. 60 miles they would walk those guys. Every day. Every day. Until they, it would take them sometimes three days to Are get they there. So they would sleep on the beach. Or? No, no, those guys are long dead, man. That was from like 1860, 1880, somewhere in there. But I thought it was a cool tribute because I lived there and a lot of times I am barefoot on the beach. But uh, they had a mission. I got a mission. Our mission was to meet you. What is your name? Mihao. Mihao. Yeah. What's going on, buddy? You? Nice meeting. Uh, my name is Terry. Terry. Yes, sir. Lovely to meet you. Terry. Yeah, same here. Listen, we got a big Polish community in um, All over South Florida. And uh, shout out to the Polish community. 
Those guys right. know a thing or two about some good food, right? Yeah. First time in uh, Thailand? Probably no, no, not. I've been here 16 years ago. Yeah. But this is my you know, the destination. Is just uh, uh, you know one day passing tomorrow, through. Passing and through. I'm going. Yeah. Where are you going? going? To Cambodia. Cambodia. I wanted to go there too. I'm gonna hit that the by next bus. time. Wow. That should be. So are you a vlogger? Yeah, yeah. I'm okay. right now. What's your so. channel? right there hold on we both got our channel hold on look we both have our shirts on a little appetizing right yeah you can't beat it awesome follow this guy barefoot vlogger oh I'm, i don't know i'm you. sticking to your viewers or my viewers yeah. I don't know. and follow him solo cold planet yeah. i love the name of the planet all right Listen, nice meeting you, my friend. Right. You take it easy and safe travels, okay? okay. I'm gonna watch, I wanna see Cambodia, cause I'm gonna go. Give me some pointers. Thanks for the shout out. Thank All right, you. brother. All right. Take care, safe travels. Guys, you got vloggers, you got photo journalists, you got guys with big boxes on their scooters that probably weighs more than the scooter itself. I don't know what he's got in there, but. And you got backpackers. Lots of backpackers. Hold on, let me go now. Oh, man. Oh, I blew it. All right, I made it. So, it's a big mixed bag here. It's a big mixed bag, and it's fun. You just never know what you're gonna get. Okay, guys, the GPS is going to have us reach our final destination in two minutes, 160 meters, so. Curious to see what exactly that is. Guys, as much as I love the uh, makeshift rope that my friend made for me in Chinatown, um, I want to get something that is uh, going to do it a little more justice and respect. So I'm here in this store, and uh, I don't know, what do you think? How does that look? That might work. That's pretty cool, actually. You think? Let's see if she can. can would this work for this? Can you do it for me? Can you put it on? Okay, if you put it on, I buy it. How much? One. One ninety. One ninety. Well, one twenty. No. Oh, I understand. Okay, I give you one ninety. No problem. Give you guys some good business. Come here, guys. What's the name of your store? Shop. Shop. Okay, come to the shop, guys, and give them some good business. How are, Where are you? you from? I'm from Florida. United Florida. States. Yeah. Oh. How about you? I'm from Philippines. But Philippines. I work here in Thailand. That's the next place I'm going. How are you? My name is Terry. It's nice yeah, to meet you. Yeah, my name is Robert. Nice Robert. To meet you oh, you too. speak wonderful English. Thank you. You know us Americans, we're spoiled. We, we only speak one language. We try. We because dabble. Our, because our country was colonized by the Americans. I know That's that. That's why. I know that. We know. I, I hope you're happy about that. Of course. Okay. Of course. <laughs> we are welcoming with the Americans. That's because why. you know most colonizations they don't go too well. Uh, they, they, I mean, hey, we were co we colonized, right? That's why many people are going to America as well. Many yeah. Filipinos work in America. Yeah. They like Americans. Wow, we love the we Filipinos. Love, love. Filipinos, they're great people. Yes. In fact, a lot of our businesses have your country course, is our yeah. customer service and customer care yes, and all yes, that yes. so can i see him doing this let me see him doing this oh look he's uh okay thank you beautiful it's good luck right it's good luck is it worth something uh-oh break out the little monocle maybe it's really worth something what do you think? What do I got there? Something good? Oh, it's an ancient relic worth thousands. Guys, I'm really liking that chain. I may never take that thing off. Okay. Good? Here, 200. Okay. Who gets the money? You? Oh, so I can just pull it apart and do it. Can you hold the camera for me for one second? Okay. What, I pull? Just pull? Oh, screw, screw, okay. See if I can do this on my own. I think I got it. How's it look? Looks good? Awesome. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Very helpful, guys. This uh, this worked out great. I'm so happy. And you know what? I'm gonna keep that string that my friend gave me anyway. See, he's even giving it back to me. Oh. My friend. 
Oh, I give you a chance too. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Come to visit him. Come to visit him. Very nice people here. Good job. Thank you. I hope you guys like it better. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. What do you guys think? You better say you like it. I paid more for the chain than I did for the amulet. All in, 360. Chain, amulet. In the meantime, GPS says we'll be there in one minute. Wherever there is, we are about to find out. Together, on our Samfeng Market Daytime Adventure. Thanks for joining me. Make sure this is on your list of things to do and see when you come here, especially especially if you want to shop. I mean, I would come here even without shopping. Usually, though, you end up spending some money, right? Like I just did. And that's a good thing. You know, the one thing I don't see here yet is food. But uh, they couldn't, they probably couldn't fit that in here. I'll bet you there's food around here somewhere though. Speak English? Food? Food? That way. Not Nothing that way. Oh, this is where it ends here? Finish. Thank you. Thank you. So you got to go back to Chinatown to get the food. And I'll, I'll tell you what, that rice bowl that I had filled me up pretty good. It's still going though, guys. It's still going on the other side of the street. Apparently the way to cross the street is uh, to just basically walk into the oncoming traffic and let them miss you. It's always good to have a human shield in front of you. There we go. There we go. There you go. Just walk and hope for them to stop and they did. Alright. Here we go. Round two. A lot of naked birds running around somewhere. <laughs> I tell you what guys, this market, this long skinny alley is is stretches longer than any beach walk I think I've ever taken. Oh, I spoke too soon. We got food. We got fruit here. We got a fruit car. We got bananas. We got oranges. What else we got in there? Mangoes. Watch the toes. Watch the toes. It's the Thai Bed Bath and Beyond. She doesn't know what Bed Bath and Beyond is. I guess it's something strawberry. Reminds me of Frankenberry. Remember Frankenberry and Count Chocula? Nobody liked Frankenberry. Everybody liked Count Chocula. Alright guys, I see, a, I see an opening here that looks a little different than anything we've seen. Not sure if it's just another street or something else. No, it's something else indeed. It's the piazza. Yeah, yeah. We have a band that is about to perform right here on the canals. You can see, guys, from this point, the buildings that were surrounding us on either side, within which we just walked through. Oh, 
Oh, a little John Denver. Blue Ridge Mountain, Shenandoah River. Well guys, I don't think we're going to be able to top that. I hope you enjoyed our tour today of the San Fan Market here near Chinatown in Bangkok, Thailand. Till next time, country roads, take me home. Just not yet, not yet.